मार्च 2021, एज वी सेलिब्रेट द स्प्रिंग ऑफ 2021 in the best possible splurging manner one finds it difficult to forget what we have gone through 23rd march 2020 the day when complete lockdown was imposed on us indians something that none of us had heard before we were locked within the confines of the four walls all of us irrespective of age place gender profession social status underwent something that was unheard of quarantine books 33 decided to capture the lockdown lives from the eyes of different people in different spheres our idea gave birth to a book called unlockdown memories 15 short stories a bouquet of shared experiences pulled together by the editorial team of books 33 to know more on these 15 nuggets from their authors from across length and breadth of india you are cordially invited in the book launch of unlockdown memories 15 short stories on the auspicious World Storytelling Day on 20th March 2021 with none other than Dr. Radha Krishnan Pillai popularly known as Chanakya Pillai as the chief guest Professor Shalini Verma lifeaholic the co-founder of Books 33 Sunita Mishra the editor of this book Dr Monica Khanna a consistent support behind this title and all the 15 authors This was not the first time that mother nature has punished us with the pandemic There have been multiple such instances in the pages of history when the human kind has been hit by the worst of pandemics To know more read Back to Darwin a short story by Vikramjit Sen Every cloud has a silver lining and so it is with the pandemic too For Srishti the overall lockdown turned out to be a blessing in disguise How you ask The sweet uses of adversity A short story by Srishti Day bears it all. The two kids, Abhinav and Aditi, thought of starting a new adventure during the lockdown summer of 2020. Read in the story titled "All the Fun We Had" by nine-year-old writing prodigy Aditi Mannav. One day during the lockdown a father daughter duo hear a rumbling sound coming from the tea garden next to their place what happened next read what the lockdown taught us a story by jaya sudha bhaskaran a writer by passion and a physicist by profession the corona virus lockdown gave disha and her family ample time to halt and observe things that we earlier did not pay much attention to from non-descript places to unassuming people who live close to us and make our life simple things i didn't notice before a short story by disha soni shares some personal experiences from the lockdown days how to control them the only scratch of a sentence that diksha could hear as a result of some serious eve dropping on her parents what happened next read that secret mission a short story by diksha anand a class 3 student at hyderabad's silver oaks international school
mood swings no i have none do i want to kick somebody one moment and hug them the next sometimes yes but that is no mood swing months before the corona virus pandemic struck sneha anand an hr executive at a psu was in two minds about motherhood anand story lockdown lullaby captures her transition from reluctance to dilemma doubt fear and finally acceptance and then the arrival of a baby in the middle of the lockdown for the year 2021 neeti had not made many resolutions but why read in silence is golden a short story by neeti yadav an engineer with a passion for writing the covid experience of rini's family lasted more than 3 months during this time they experienced something quite unfamiliar what was that rini tells in her story the spiked blessing the lockdown divided people in two categories one type got upset for being forced to stay indoors and the other utilized this time to learn new things in look forward to getting back the old normal riya gora tells us which category she falls in Shazia lived in a happy family of 5 members before the pandemic lockdown changed it all Shazia Shaheen tells us what changed in her story dealing with the loss of a dear one I see that you are quite ignorant you should wear the mask properly The sentence was rude enough to annoy Shivrajit but what he learned about that speaker a little while later would send a chill down his spine what happened read that conversation with the mask man a short story by shivrajit kamila a student of calcutta university to know more the old woman whom the children called granny had become more and more forgetful as her dementia worsened in the middle of the pandemic she felt an irresistible craving for momos what was her family yet to explore read the momo magic a short story by soma mukherjee a model corporate trainer actor and a writer With the announcement of a lockdown a few days later, Shreya's exams were first postponed and later cancelled. This was a piece of news most 7th graders felt elated about. Shreya Revankar, a 13-year-old class 8th student from Mangaluru, explains how the lockdown brought out the writer in her. After passing the second grade exams, Anagha was looking forward to joining classes for third grade. But then came the school strange decision of moving to online classes. What happened next? Read in Getting Cool with Online School, story by M Anagha Manogya, a student of class 3 in Hyderabad Silver Oak School. Be friend books with books 33 a home of the authors by the authors and for the authors